MC Mining K-Man here, and welcome to this next episode on the CrystalCraft server. As uh, most of you who follow me know, I have been absent from the server and Minecraft in general for three weeks, almost four weeks, and that was due to quite a few reasons. Uh, one being uh, didn't have time. Uh, things just kept happening during the week that uh, was preventing me from being able to devote the time to uh, collect resources and do stuff and uh, uh, make video content that uh, these Minecraft episodes take effort in planning and uh, putting together. And uh, being... I was getting a little burnt out on it. I figured I would take a uh, break from it and do some other things. And uh, some of those other things were, uh, I haven't really uh, promoted it at all, but uh, I have a uh, another series on uh, YouTube called Caveman Plays. And it's just me playing through some uh, other games uh, one was uh, Half-Life 2. I played one of its uh, single-level uh, missions. And thinking about playing through the game again, I uh, haven't fully committed to it yet. Uh, been spent a lot of time playing uh, Hawken, which is a, uh, uh, a game where you climb inside a, a metal, well, a... a what am I trying to mech? Uh, a robot. Uh, it's like Mech Warrior. It's a single, well, it's a multiplayer uh, PvP thing. Actually, let me get out of F1. There we go. Uh, single player, not single, why do I keep saying single player? Multiplayer PvP. You just do quick battles. It usually takes about 10 minutes to play. Uh, I've also been uh, playing Mass Effect 3 multiplayer again. Okay, so armor. I'm having to refamiliarize myself with some of this stuff. Uh, Jay Flory uh, mentioned a while ago that signs got messed up due to an update. So it looks like I'm not even sure. Let's see, that's. I left null is where I didn't type anything. And that would have been the and symbol on those. But why does it have that? It should have just said animal spawn eggs or something like that. And then this was hostile spawn eggs. Don't know what that extra stuff is. But... Um, also, my headset's been having issues, and that's why a lot of my other videos that I've been putting out uh, the past couple of weeks on my channel uh, don't have me speaking at all, is because the audio seems to be very, uh, very selective on what game. Uh, by that I mean every game I set the audio settings to, it is not compatible with the uh, next game I play. Uh, so when I was doing the Half-Life, the uh, world sound was really loud and drowned out my voice. And then I tried something else, and my uh, my voice completely drained, uh, drowned out the uh, the uh, the game sounds. So for and I'm not changing any settings on my computer. So I thinking I need to just up uh, go back to get well get a, another USB headset versus a uh, 3.55 or 3.5 millimeter uh, audio jacks. And I did do did hop on a few times to. Uh, Get a little bit of my museum worked on. Uh, I hope this didn't mess up 
USE. Um, actually, what are my homes? It's been so long. Museum old. Home USE. Hope I didn't mess up the signs too badly here because that would really make it hard for me to relabel stuff as it moves. Oh, those are some waypoints in the background. Let me turn those off real quick. All right, got those turned off. Um, using Forge with Light Loader and have a minimap installed, but I don't even use the minimap. I just use it for uh, waypoints, save all the locations I've been to. So these uh, signs look like they're okay. And... Uh, are the named items inside okay? Yeah. Uh, let's hop over to Stone Swords, which is SSII. Stone Swords 2. I've not had a chance to look at. Yeah, it looks like something blew up there. Looks like something. Oh, just a moment. Ugh. These these uh, headset that I have makes my ears sweat. Actually, um, don't know if there's been much activity going on. No, there's railings put on this it looks nice just do a quick peruse around i guess he plans on building more levels yep all right and the cats The only thing they're good for is nothing in this game. They will sit on your chest and you can't open them. Let's see, where are these? Oh, see, these are messed up too. My water fountain still present and working. Oh my. The enchanting room. Bottles, arrows, potions. Huh. I think it was just a quick storage. Oh, yeah. We got the. Uh, oh, it's been cleaned up again. No. Oh, that. Is, ooh. And I don't have armor or a weapon. He's got somebody's death outfit there we go huh he didn't drop anything i guess he spawned like that then now i need to find some food 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 oh, i got some in my energy oh that startled me for a moment <laughs> So, let's see how much this... Oh, wow. So, a double chest. And some. I don't know if there's a... That's one of them. I don't know if there's a random pattern or not to how these uh, fill in. Let's see. So, almost two double chests worth. That's pretty good. So, uh, that was one of the last things that I highlighted. And, oh yeah, uh, Jester's uh, uh, crafting table house got <laughs> struck by lightning and burned down. So this is all inventory and raid items that get quickly dumped here. Huh. Alright. So we've 
well, not when I say we, <laughs> I mean Alex pretty much. He's torn out the uh, mechanics, as it were, of most of this. And he's been faithfully working on the new one. Home shorter new. You know, let me just get some food real quick. So, actually, the last thing I did before I took my little hiatus was to straighten out this floor so that it was more centered. And he has expanded this significantly because it was just this first layer and and I don't think all the chests were even down yet. But I went through and uh, stone bricked uh, the stuff that had the redstone that was going to be put. But he's gone through and added the second layer and all the redstone. And he's doing, I guess he's doing this design. So you can reach and you can reach. So that's really nice. So he's put in Skype saying that anybody can drop in any four of these chests. And it drops it into a, a water channel down here. And then the water channel shoots it up into an item uh, elevator and sends it into that hopper. And then it looks like the hopper goes clockwise. Yep, it goes clockwise around the top. Oh, got to be careful of those intermen. Okay, so clockwise, clockwise, clockwise. So it must drop to the second layer down here. Yep, drops down to this and then goes counterclockwise all the way around. Which means the last one would be back over here. Oh, and that's what that one meant by unsorted. Okay, well that's pretty impressive. Yep, unsorted. So anything that does goes through the whole system and doesn't find a spot for it will end up back in here. Okay, that's pretty cool. Uh, let me show you home sphere. That one I'll never forget. I'm going to show you one of these uh, mods that I've been using that, uh, as you can tell, uh, I got a little bit of this one worked on. And it takes a long time, but what you... Uh, I'm going to fumble through this, but uh, just forgive me. Anyway, there's a mod that I have and I made no that's not it is it that no no uh, it might be this one I made a yeah this is it all right and then so I had made a copy of an in-game copy of what I had currently built. And then you need to, there it is, you need to rotate once. Yeah, there it is. All right, then I need to press that button and rotate again. And rotate again. Which way is it going? Okay, it's going back. And is it getting closer? Yes, it's getting closer. All right, so it's getting 
So change that out with the 100. There it is. Now this isn't an easy thing to uh, control, but all right. So now I slowly add some, add some, and then I have to exit out of the menu and then come back over here, turn on the menu again. And if I line up this redstone, there we go. So now I can leave that active. And I just grab some stone and then grab some of my dirt. It's got a template, so I still have to build one. Well, I have to build it all, but now I only have to measure out one quarter of the sphere. Now, this is just a ghost. This is not, there's nothing here. And so, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, well. That was just a waste of uh, some some smooth stone. Too many people at spawn. Is it going to send me? Oh, if I type an E. Everybody's trying to punch me hello. And all right, turn that off. Now I'm going to have to turn it back on and let's see. Oh, that marks where, where is it? Maybe I've never died with it on before. Uh, do I have to turn it back on again like this? Yes. Okay, and so let me let me get this all lined up and I'll show you. All right, I'm back. So this uh, light blue is ghost image. So there's nothing there. So what it tells you is this is where I need to place the blocks to uh, build my sphere to the exact same shape uh, that I had measured out on the other side and so it's nice and easy on this spot where it's more than one block wide because you can just keep connecting it and going but on some of these where it's only here i'll show you it so you get to here well i could throw a block uh, uh let me you can hide it there there it goes so that's what it looks like so if i throw a block here that is that would mess up my sphere the uh, perfect sphere shape now you wouldn't be able to see it on the inside but you would see it on the outside so what i end up having to do is put dirt there and then continue on and that's what i was doing to build the other side anyways and then you go back through and remove the dirt and everything's good like that and you just keep going i got to be careful because i have fallen through a couple times as you saw uh falling through the ghost blocks they're just placement holders of where i need to place blocks so it's not a hack or a cheat or anything because i still have to manually build the entire thing but that's one uh, so i just need to uh completely build this quarter of the sphere at least to the halfway point and then i can uh make a an image copy of it and rotate it and then place it rotate it for the other uh quarter spheres and uh and do this image and fill in the blocks. Makes it a lot easier than having to use a circle calculator 
uh, every single line that I build. It takes way too much time to do that. So, dirt in there. All right, and one other reason uh, that I've been absent for a while is the uh, new museum that I've been working on. All right, let me hop over to the museum and uh, been doing a little bit more work there, but it takes quite a bit of time. So I moved a bunch of stuff into here and that's about it. Oh, sorry. Uh, that's about it as far as uh, as far as uh, moving stuff around because I haven't moved any more stuff in here. But I smoothed out the ceiling and uh, took out the center column, but made this little. I was testing out a, a light pattern for up on the top. Uh, I haven't done anything with the. Uh, uh, side room and I haven't even started that side room yet I was thinking about and I'll probably still do it but one of one of every item uh, kind of like the item sorter where it's gonna have everything in the world but uh, just have one of everything and might do it like Zisto is doing it on his single player uh, where it's uh, broken down to uh, what was added per uh, Per Minecraft uh, update, but anyway, the uh, drop party stuff starts here, and it would go. It goes this way, and then you hook back around this way, and then you have to cut across here. I mean, it's not the best flow of things. Then I oh, forgot the arrows. Oh, the. Uh, text is fine here also and then it'll wrap this way I don't remember how far I need to go but over here is primarily going to be server stuff uh, that isn't part of a drop party so armor sets and other things PvP kits Jedi army kit uh, these five are full of heads that are still being sorted but yeah, that's uh, that's what I've been doing around here. It looks pretty nice to as a uh, as a sterile environment, but it really needs something in the middle. And I really wish that I could uh, have something here. <laughs> Oh, wow. I mean, I mean, wow, that is, uh, that is, that is pretty much what my museum needs. Cool. I got the spawn crystal. You know what? I think, I think Echo Fox was looking for someone who stole the spawn crystal well it wasn't me and uh ah you know what this isn't the original spawn crystal it's not made out of ice it's got the diagonals in it this is made out of glass oh well powers that be thank you i i will appreciate this I should probably go ask uh, some other uh, Minecrafters for some more quartz to build the uh, uh, the uh, ring around it. So uh, the containment, yeah, containment ring around it. That sh that would add the finishing touch to this. Maybe maybe I should go ask Marshox if he's got any uh, more quartz for me to use because I've used quite a bit on the floor and the pillars and making all these stairs and stuff 
So yeah, I'll have to go meet him in his uh, nether place and see if he will let me have any of his quartz. Anyway, I think that will be it for this episode. Ah, oh, that thing's a beauty, isn't it? So anyway, I will uh, see you next time, and uh, hopefully it won't be another three weeks before that happens. Uh, please leave a like down below, and uh, I'll see you all next time. Bye. Thank you.